As climate change, land use changes, and invasive species increasingly threaten our nation's ecosystems, scientists need a revolutionary system to identify the long-term ecological impacts of these threats. That's why the National Science Foundation is funding the National Ecological Observatory Network, or NEON, a first-of-its-kind nationwide sensing instrument. Similar to an EKG, which uses strategically located sensors to measure heart activity, NEON will use strategically located sensors to measure long-term ecological activity. These sensors will collect data from 106 locations that were strategically selected to represent the diversity of U.S. ecosystems. Additional locations will be added to represent extreme events, like wildfires, droughts, and hurricanes. Resulting data will enable scientists to, for the first time ever, detect large-scale problems in the health of U.S. ecosystems. At each NEON location, the same important ecological variables will be simultaneously measured, according to the same standards, by field crews and by calibrated, cutting-edge sensors positioned in streams, soils, towers, and plains. These measurements will be linked together and integrated via a state-of-the-art cyber infrastructure. Resulting data, along with models and educational resources, will be made publicly available online. NEON's uniquely standardized design will enable scientists to generate the first apples-to-apples -apples comparisons of the health of U.S. ecosystems at regional and national scales throughout time. While other existing research networks have limited topical, geographical, or temporal coverage, NEON's measurements will provide sufficient precision, sampling, and replication to support the first interpretations of large-scale ecological trends that develop over decades amidst daily, seasonal, and annual variations. NEON functions are now being turned on incrementally. In about 2017, NEON will become fully functional and will operate until about 2047. Throughout its 30-year lifespan, NEON's revolutionary resources will be used by tens of thousands of researchers, students, decision makers, educators, and citizens. So far, NEON's accomplishments include collecting remotely sensed data from a huge burn scar created by Colorado's High Park wildfire in 2012. This data, which shows precedent-setting detail, will be used to improve predictions of post-fire flooding, erosion, forest recovery, and wildlife behavior. Additionally, NEON's project Budburst, a nationwide group of 13,000 citizen scientists, has been collecting data on plant responses to climate change. NEON's unique and varied resources will catapult forward our understanding of the Earth's responses to environmental change in order to help society conserve precious natural resources 